We just bought this unit for under four thousand dollars. Pirates, welcome back. We are about to go through what I call some nice little jackpots. When I bought the $3,800 storage unit, I took everything back to the warehouse. Everything that was cool that got set inside and everything that was not that cool went to the flea market. And we have this right here. Look, 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 look. All of this great treasure. 49ers. This one is marked sports card, I think it says. This one is maybe toys. And we got all this treasure to go through and see what else is left from this $3,800 storage. Who's ready? Let's get pillaging. <laughs> Hold on, Michael, what seems the most interesting to you? We're just gonna go through a few boxes here. We're gonna get some going. This is unseen territory from this unit. I, I'm gonna, you're not gonna pick, I'm gonna pick. Fishing reels, it says. Hopefully that's really what it is because a lot of people have been asking us for fishing reels. And I'm not a big expert on them, but that's kind of neat. Look at that. This is the kind we used to use when me, you, and Michaela used to go to Hidden Lakes, remember? Yeah. All the time. She used to, you didn't like fishing as much as her. She was like, let's go fishing. That's neat. It's just a little spool. Feel the metal on that. It's different, huh? It's all technical. Oh, what the heck? Bro, that's what that other thing goes. I have never seen. <laughs> we have, you should look that one up. Ella cast. That could be valuable. I mean, I never, never seen that one. In all my years of fishing, we got a Hawthorne Montgomery Ward, so that's kind of cool. Another Zebco. I always like these. I, 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 they seem like they're very trivial, but I always like them just because of the convenience of how to use them, you know? All right. And another fly fishing reel right here. That's a cool one. Part of a bobber. Put that right here. Let's go through this box right here. Ooh, greatest team in NFL history, unless you're playing against the Eagles in a 2023 championship. <laughs> um, we got two of them. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, bro. Is that Donatello? Those are kind of cool. What year are those? Probably 2004. 2012. That's a little new, but I still I still like those. We're going to probably uh, maybe have some more. What's that? I don't know. Kiss. Kiss. So there's no action figures. It just spells out kiss. Do we have kiss figures in this, this unit? Oh. Uh-huh. Mr. Potato Head and a bucket of fun. What in the world are these, Michael? Look. <laughs> is, is that a Spongebob character or something? I don't think so. I think uh -huh. it's just... We got Spongebob, uh, Potato Head Guy, Coca Cola Bottle. These are cool. I don't know what the heck these are. Could these have some value? Your favorite food in the world, carrots. Raphael? No. Michelangelo? Leonardo. Yep, there you go. Here we go. No? That was my that was my rock my rock out. Those are kinda cool. I don't think I've ever found these. Probably found them only in the box before and so I never seen them out of the, the thing. Here's another one. He's got this whole little kiss outfit on and We're gonna kiss. I don't know any kiss songs, so don't quote me on that. Look at this guy. Dun, 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 dun. Sing a kiss song for me. Okay. And let's see what is. Oh. Let's see that again. Hold on. Pretty cool, huh? Pretty Wait, wicked. one more time. It's pretty wicked. Oh, these. Wow. Those are freaking tight. Look at the price on them. You don't find anything yeah. that cheap, Michael. You can't even buy a stick of gum. They're all the same thing, right? That's kind of nice. They're the same thing, yeah. 
Interesting. I don't know about this. That's weird. I like this stuff for... Ooh, it's freaking Charizard. Yoshi. Oh, Yoshi. <laughs> Animaniacs right there. Those are kind of cool. Weird stuff. There's like a lot of weird things. Like... They say skeleton animals. We'll be putting all this stuff right into the show, so I don't, I don't know. Monster magic trading cards. Is that what those things were? Yeah. And a couple more animaniacs here. Oh, that's actually a, a Taco Bell Chihuahua dog. And then we got this unique Ichiru Major League Baseball action figure, guys. That's pretty tight right there. That is a cool little box. I think there's a couple hundred bucks cumulatively, all right there. All right, there was some cards in here. Ooh, look at that. Barry Sanders, football, Shaquille O'Neal, basketball. Okay, some football, Dan Marino. He was a legend in his own mind. He was good at selling uh, isotoner gloves. That's kind of cool, some football cards there. Oh, it looks like there's like a whole freaking bunch. Like, look at that. What is that? Raider, Raider, Raiders. Those are not as desirable. Oh, wow. Carl Malone, bro. That's the male, man. What do you know about him? I don't. Holy crap. They obviously know about him. He has every Carl Malone player, and imagine that. Ooh, what, is this more random? Can this be random? Jerry Stackhouse, Stefan Marbury. This looks like more like a set. The other one was a whole binder, so. Okay. Maybe some key players? That's kind of cool. I like big binders like that. What do we got here? Oh. That looks exciting, doesn't it? Let's come on over here. Ooh. Planet of the Apes, Michael. Okay. Not sports, but that's still cool. I'm definitely not going to scoff at that. What? What are these? They're weird. It's like a whole... Ooh. Okay, we got Superman. Beatles. Wacky packages. Gosh. All right. Let's see. What we got. Let's come down here and look this way. Look, more wacky packages. Ooh. It's a package. Oh, these are... Please be sealed. That's sealed, Michael. You know what could be in there? What if we have like an atom bomb? Dang it, this one looks... That's a wacky package, though. That's pretty tight, though, huh? Yeah. That's a, that's a nice little find right there. Um, a bunch more of these wacky packages, wacky packages. Collect them all. It looks like more of those. What do we got here? Star Trek cards. Okay, we got more Star Trek cards. We got Batman cards. Holy crap. We've been asked for about those a lot lately, huh? Look yeah. how old those are. Are those worth something? 1966? They might be. I don't know. Because I don't really find Batman cards. Let me slide this down a little bit. These are not in the bestest shape, but I still think they're cool. More Superman. More wacky packages. What are these right here? Come on. What in the heck are these, Michael? What in the freaking frick? Pretty old. Yeah. I never seen these. Those are neat. They're like old newspapers. I don't know. We're gonna have a card show on Tuesday. Ooh. 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 We're gonna have a card show on Tuesday, so. I think these are gonna be one, two, three, four, five. There's only five and it says collect all six. Oh. Looks like we got a bunch of randomness here. Some more packs of stuff here. Deadpool. Flintstones. Bro, I'm excited about this. I'm excited about this. Yo, MTV Raps, guys. Look at that, Vanilla Ice. 
I follow him on TikTok. He's actually kind of cool. I got a cool TikTok. He owns a construction business and doing some big things. Uh, shout out to him. We have Indiana Jones sticker pack there or Last Action Hero. New Kids on the Block. This is interesting. We have Beetlejuice sealed packages. Wow. I'll show you guys some more cards here. Look at that. Ooh, what the hell are those, Michael? Waterworld Heroes card collection. Waterworld, right? Look at that. There's like a wide variety of different things here. This is not sports cards. These are like all of our childhood favorite things. Oh, the, oh. look that one up. If not, you can have it. Actually, I don't. It's fine. I don't. I don't need your fucking cards. These are the ones I gave away last time. Mm, are you sure? Mm -hmm. we had like, I swear, this is we had like three of these and I put it in a stack. Dang, because I sold a Dragon Ball card for nine hundred bucks once. Yeah, they can one be expensive. Card. They can be really expensive. I have a stack at home. It'd be expensive. It's a lot of cards here, guys. Just randomness. Scooby Doo. What is this one? Oh, he really liked that one. He had it all. He had it all set aside. Then we got Three's Company. I didn't even know Mr. Furley had his own freaking card. I'm finding the Mr. Furley rookie card, guys, and I'm getting it freaking graded. Archie's, Ninja Turtles, Jaws. Another pack here. What are those? Bubble Funnies? Archie's? Guys, that's awesome. What do you guys think about that box? This unit has been hitting. I mean, I got laughed at a little bit because I went high, and um, the, the comic book collection wasn't like, it wasn't, you know, Incredible Hulk 1, etc. So it wasn't like the, just the most amazing comics. We found some great ones. We sold a set of Bone the other day. Four of them for like 200 and something on our auction. We've been doing some good comics on their stuff. But then it's nice to find these little hits like this. Because we're, we're I think we're probably about even. Or we're in the profit now. So like everything we sell at this point actually is profit on that storage unit. So that's pretty kind of cool. Let's see what's in the next box. Okay. I mean, it's weird. Old. It's weird because every oh, holy crap, <laughs> bro! That that could be valuable just there in itself. I will stand corrected. Um, the cards were going on Tuesday show. We have a cards only show, so this will probably be Monday as this comes out. So just so you know, this is probably worth 10, 15 bucks right here. I would imagine. Winnie the Pooh, Winnie the Pooh. That's kind of cool. There's a lot of vintage toys and stuff that I just That I, I'm, I'm a bit intrigued by no loitering anyone in this area will not be dispatched to work. Is that what it says? Yeah Okay Hi everybody, I'm Cammy the kangaroo. I already had to take a break He'll be back in a minute I have no idea what that is. I just thought that was funny. Um, I've been finding some Hanna Barbera stuff. Let me let me sh let me give you guys an update here real quick. Let me give them a little update. I listed these on eBay the other day. Michael. So, uh, very seldom in life do you find something that you can't find like a comp on. I had to dig deep, but this character is not as pricey. This one I did list high. Um, his name is not Yippy Dog, but I, for, I, I off the top of my head I can't remember. But these two guys right here are from Sneasley and Breezley. I started to put this one on auction without knowing what it was, and then I got to this one. I'm like, neither one of these existed on an eBay comp. Very seldom can you not find something. These have not sold since 2018 for 238 bucks for this one, and this one doesn't even have a comp. So I list, I went high, and I listed mine for 777 dollars a piece on those two dolls because no one has them for sale. And this guy right here is a rare Japanese version of a Gorilla Gorilla. They're up for 500 on eBay. I listed mine for 300, and this tag uh, has a tag on the Drupalong doll. I actually listed that one pretty high too because there's none for sale. But I always do more research later on when I find something. I don't always just do it right away in the video. It's more like we make the video and we come back. Ooh, I only listed him for 50 to be honest with you. So yeah, that was a cool find. I was out of this unit and the Hanna-Barbera stuff is actually rather oddly cool. Here we go, we got Mr. Potato Head. And what is this? It's a board game. This actually might be a little bit valuable. I've never seen this before. projector. Okay. See them? Can you, yeah. There we go, look at that. That is neat. 
that's got to be a few bucks right there. Got and to. It, well, yeah, it has to be. And then what is this guy? Is this Slowpoke Gonzalez? Speedy Rodriguez's uh, brother? Ooh. Big boy. Right here, we guys, we have a history of big... I used to love this. It used to be one not across from your Nance house, Bob's Big Boy, when I was a kid. I used to love freaking going there and eating. Yellow cab, juicy cab. What is that? Oh, that like that. It's me a yellow cab driver. I should wear this when I drive around since I do all the driving and you're just in the passenger seat and I can be like a cab driver. Right. What is that? You see that? <laughs> what in the... I think we should bring this home and start saying, you know how the girls do this to us all the time? What do you think? Start Because this one looks hecka real. <laughs> The girls always be playing that game where they put spiders everywhere. Mainly Eviana, or is it Eviana who does it? I think it's yeah. Eviana. What are these, little paintings? A. Everson, somebody must have been an artist and they were just doing some art. Sam, okay, so if you see me. You can put them everywhere, Michael. What do you think? You want one? I want one. We'll just start putting them everywhere. <laughs> no. I'm gonna do it. Do it. It's pretty cool. Yeah. Look at that. Oh, you just broke it. Shaken, not stirred. I didn't even know what that was, so now I do. That's kind of cool, a little Herald's Club. It's pretty neat. A lot of little trinkets. I don't. These I don't think we'll we'll do much with because they're just they don't seem they're very special. And at the same time, oh wait a minute, those are kind of. You should give that one to your grandma. Oh, oh, bro, call Walt Disney. I found Nemo. He found him. My pet rock. And yeah, that's pretty cool, guys. I think that's cool. We got. Hopefully a couple more boxes to go inside this unit, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this unboxing. Got to get back to work. Look around, Michael. Show them all this stuff. We got auction stuff. Whatnot's happening this Sunday. We got uh, whatnot's happening next Sunday. We got the whole studio. Sticks, picks. Appreciate it. Ah, you know it's best. You can never mess with storage auction pirate. Subscribe. <laughs>